Okay, hello, I'm Patrick Parker, the CEO of EmpowerID. Here to give you a quick overview of our universal connector. So in the modern enterprise, you're connecting to many, many different types of systems. Some of them are extremely well known, like Salesforce, Amazon Web Services, Azure, Office 365. So you can have standard connectors to pull data in, learning who has access to what, which users are in those systems, which resources that you want to protect for certification, for provisioning and deprovisioning. Now there are other systems that organizations have. The bulk of their systems are often custom systems or less well-known systems for which an existing connector would not uh, exist from any vendor. So those systems offer the ability to have a flat file feed dumped out, access to the data in the database, or even an API in some cases, which makes it even easier. Now the goal of the universal connector is for all of those systems to minimize the amount of custom code to minimize the possibility of something breaking and something that you have to maintain on upgrade and retest. So the Universal Connector allows all of those systems to feed in to one common format, one common database. Now that system is well known by Empower ID. It can automatically inventory that system. Um, it can pull in any data from any of those other systems, including entitlements and access, uh, external roles in an HR system, external divisions and departments. So it's automatically ready, set, to go to pull into EmpowerID's identity warehouse for automated provisioning, deprovisioning, and downstream systems. All you have to do is just get the data out into the common format, no custom code, EmpowerID will pick it up, automate processing in the downstream systems. Now in the event that you'd like to provision or deprovision back to these systems, very, very easy just to plug in an outbound connection, which will talk to that system's API, talk to its database, or export a flat file, CSV, XML, and those systems could then be the recipients of those changes based upon role changes, based upon self-service, to provision or deprovision access. So the universal connector ties together the custom systems or less well-known systems with your well-known commercial systems in the cloud or on-premise. Thank you. Excellent. Thanks, Patrick.